Who do I write for? I found myself asking this question. I guess I'm trying to be more conscious of the decisions I'm making. So who do I write for? I write for myself, I guess. My way to untie knots of stress from holding back my tongue on what is socially or politically correct. It is my discipline. It's how I train. Eyes closed, ears open, let the world be my music to zen. Think twice before you speak, pick up the pen, and know I'm not perfect, so yes, I write to keep myself sane. I write for my reflection in a mirror, because sometimes I feel that it is someone else, and I realize that yes, it is something else. There are cracks beneath the surface, don't always trust your eyes because they can deceive, when every day we have to wear a mask. Every day is a journey of self-esteem, self-worth to be redeemed. So I write for you to forget the reflection. Hold your heart instead, because we're all just being psychologically screwed by some media heads. I write for the truth. I write because nobody listens. I write for this world that's been constructed into a system, a systematic chain that thrives on us being the same, to continue manufacturing for riches that we will never obtain. So I write to heal every man who uses hate as a tool of destruction, which is only because of the absence of love that wasn't hammered in, screwed on to the foundation of your construction. I write for the men and women who grind and grind time after time to sustain a family. And society doesn't give you one moment of weakness, and you don't even give yourself a chance to ask why oppressing yourself, causing you to commit that crime of finding pleasure outside, from the arms of another woman or a glass of wine, using your fists as a way to cry, finding comfort anywhere else but inside yourself. I write to educate myself, for brothers and sisters who didn't get a chance to better themselves, and for too long being taught this idea of being white is being pure. How on earth can you rise up when the very essence of you is your flaw? Please don't run away from who you are because I found out there is no cure. So I write for the people who don't realize ignorance isn't a bliss. And in order for us to progress into the future, it is our education of history that must be fixed. I write for the beauty of knowledge and truth, but most importantly, right at this moment, I write for you.